Hi guys, what's going on? It's Nook. Welcome along to episode number 11 of Human Resource Machine. Last time around, we climbed to the top of the corporate ladder. We got our end program congratulat congratulatory coffee even. And we currently have one, two, three, four, five down this left-hand side that I want to kind of like work on first. Um, and see if we can get through these before we, um, you know, progress any further. So let's kick things off here today with three sort on year 28. Yes, we all rank our employees here. Also, quickly. Uh, oh, I can't do it. Uh, I can't do it. Oh, anyway. Uh, something Deathwish mentioned. I'm going to start capturing my cursor again. I turned it off initially because... I thought it might be annoying, but apparently I've been like trying to circle things and do different things, and um, you guys clearly can't see um, what I'm doing because my mask curse has been off. Also, I apologize for like staring down there because I was just turning my timer on. Anyway, uh, from worst per performing all the way up to best performing. What? Where do you rank? Let's give it some thought while we complete this assignment. For each three things in the inbox, send them to the outbox in order from smallest to largest. Do you know how we do this one? Hold on, hold on, hold on a moment. All right, exit game. What am I doing? No! <laughs> Great start, knock. Jeez. Didn't I just do this one like further up the ladder? You know what I did here on sorting floor? Yeah, but this is this is on like a bigger scale, I guess. Hmm. All right, anyway. So this one should be pretty easy. I'm not going to copy. I'm going to like try and see if we can do it from memory. Okay, anyway. La 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 la. All right, so. Copy everything from there. And we have that one. So if we subtract from one... If it's a negative number, the second is higher, right? <sighs> right, okay, so subtract from one. If we have negative number, the second is higher, okay? So then we need to... My, my brain is turned to mush. What's going on? Generally, I can't think of what I need to do. Alright, so. If it's negative. Um... Then one is greater than two. So I'm going to copy from Hold on, hold on. Well, let's just think about this. Two. Two minus four is minus two. All right, let's just do it the, the, the stupid way. All right, so what we need to do first, actually, is then we need to... So if it's that, we need to add... I need to make copies. Sub one. If it's negative then we need to swap these two around, okay?
I don't know what I'm doing. Oh my goodness, this is embarrassing. I need to put the four down there, don't I? This, this, this needs some optimizers. All right. So if it's not, then they're in the right order. So then I need to. If that was a six and that was a three. Sorry, if that was a three and that was a six. Six minus three. So then what we can do is we can add that, and then we're going to want to sub from zero. And if it's negative. This is like a this this feels so wrong doing it like this. Not gonna lie. This is going to go on ridiculous. I'm not, not happy with this at all. That's just going to like go on for like a stupid amount of commands. Okay, so we have that. We have three in our hand. Maybe subtract from the first number first. Does that make any difference? So subtract from zero. So it's negative. So that is higher. That's a higher number than that one, right? Okay, so if it's negative. Add zero. Yeah, that gave me the one to put there, but I think I still need to copy them to the, like have a copy of them just to be safe. All right. So then, what I can do. Add zero, copy to zero. Copy from there. Copy to here. This is going down exactly the same route there that I just had a minute ago. Copy from there, copy to there. I feel like I'm just being... <laughs> so hold on, when I went and did the... When we did sorting floor, we had zero for a start, didn't we? What did I go all the way back for? 
I apologise for this episode, guys. So far, we, we're not really... We're not really being um, very productive at all, it feels. numbers not it's three numbers three numbers that's all it is three numbers just three numbers So at this point, we've not even learned how to use. Um, we've not learned how to use like the array indexes. All right, come on, come on. We got this. We already have two in our hand, so it makes sense to start with two. Subtract from one. All right, if it's negative. It's not negative. We're going to add from one to give us back two, and then we're going to subtract from zero if that's negative. So one is less than two, and then we got uh, zero. It's not less than, is it? Zero is greater than one. One is greater than two. jump back into sort of here here we want to jump back into here maybe then we're going to jump back to the beginning So let's run through this in a minute. Okay, subtract from one. So it's negative. So the first number is greater than the second number. I should see another way to do it though. So the first number. Alright, so let's scratch in the second number. So here we need to swap one and two. Do the extra copy there. I don't need to do the extra copy there, do I? As long as I keep like that there, then I can copy from here. 
copy it to two. Right? Okay. Jump back here. Right, so it's not negative. Add if one to take it back to that total. And then do that. Alright, so now I need to copy what I've got here. So it's a copy from zero. Copy to six. Copy from one. Copy to zero. Copy from six. Copy to one. back. Alright, what went wrong there? That's what went wrong. Alright, so if I do that though, if I get this one here, I actually need to jump back to... I actually then need to do a copy from here, then jump back. Massive amount of steps there. Okay, so So how's it gonna fail? We're not checking for the same, are we? What point did that fall over then? It'd be this. Would it be this? So if it's negative. Alright, so go over there. This is two. Take it back to the eight. If it's negative. Or if it's zero, we need to go there as well. So we're probably going to want to do that here as well, right? Alright, let's try it. Where did I get that from? So track one. Let's 
goes back to that one that I was stuck on before with about the negative and the positive signs, the, the minus versus the plus, etc, etc, etc. If I get to here, though, I've only checked one of the numbers, haven't I? So what I need to do there, then, is I then need to copy from one. Don't I? So, hold on. In this case, I need to... Copy from one, jump back to here. <laughs> Whoopsie! <laughs> that ain't right. That ain't right at all. Um, Is it failing on again then? I'm stuck in a loop. Zero, which it is. If it's zero there, though, I can just jump onto the next one, can't I? So I don't need that jump. Not there, I don't. I don't believe. Give me an ID and I'll just freaking knock this out in like two seconds. Jeez, give me a game environment and I'll just suck. Alright guys, sorry about that. Um, seems like we actually solved it though. Um, four more sizes, four more commands and we're massive on there. But let's, um, let's just rerun through that again because I kind of like didn't see the whole thing. So we need to trim out like four commands from somewhere. So again, it's going to be coming back for a another optimization on this one. Maybe I should start with the middle number. If I start with the middle number, I can go either way, maybe. I don't know. But then you've still got to take the other one as well and compare the first, because the first and the last still might be different. I oh, know, we'll, we'll think about it. We will think about it. All right, so... Let's move on to, we've got four of these left. Let's move on to, I'm going to leave that, that one left. Alphabetizer. I'm guessing we're going to be ordering. This optional always for advanced employees only. Buzz, buzz, yes, indeed. Goodbye. Click. Incoming message. You will receive two words. One is a decoy, a false lead, a red herring. The other is part of an important message. Okay. Determine which word comes first. If you were to order them alphabetically and send only that word to the outbox. Okay, so inbox. Copy to. Oh, hold on. Actually, no, no. So we're gonna first of all we're gonna copy from here. Copy to here. That's gonna be our working array number. Get from the inbox. Copy it to Array position that. 
IRA pause. Okay, let's copy it from there. Copy it to there. But if it's zero, next string str. ARR -R pos 2. So we're also going to want to copy from here to there. Okay. So then, once we get here, we're going to go to inbox. I'm going to copy it to that location. And if it's zero, then start. Okay, so if it's not zero, go back to there. If this is not zero, go back to there. It needs to be like that. Alright, so let's just see if we get. Oh, we're not incrementing. Copy to there. Pump that. Pump that. Alright, so let's just see if I can output both of these strings successfully. Nope, failed straight away. Alright, start again. Okay. So, everything is out. So then we need to start doing comparisons. So, we need to reset our arrays. Be another way to like do that without having to like re copy all the commands. Anyway, copy from there, copy to there, copy from here, copy to here. Then we're going to copy from here, subtract from here, and if it's zero, if it's zero. Same char. It's char is for character, by the way. That's what it's for I'll be. Um, so if it's zero, we've got the same character. We're going to increment that. Increment that. And then we're going to go back to that. Okay. So if it's negative... Actually, we only need to worry if it's negative, don't we? Jump here. So, two greater than one. Oh, no, that will be... We're subtracting top from bottom. So, if it's negative, that means one is greater than two, right? One is greater than two. If it's zero. If it's a negative. Else. Right, so if we're here, then we're going to... Two is greater than one. Copy from here. Copy to here.
Copy from there, copy to there. And... Copy from here. zero, go to the end. If it's not, we will go back to there. Okay. So then, if it's one, I'm going to copy from from 23, copy to there, copy from there, if it's zero we're going to end, else send it to the outbox, increment the array, jump back to there. Alright, let's try it. All right, well, we need to debug this program, guys. Thank you very much for watching. This is going to be the end of the video. Please leave your comments, as always, in the comments. Enjoy reading them. But until next time, I've been Nock. You've been awesome. See ya.